Students across the country walked out of classes today in protest of gun violence in schools following the shooting in Nashville, Tennessee last week that claimed the lives of six, including three kids. They're also talking about other gun related incidents in schools recently, including in Colorado at East High School in Denver. 11 News reporter Lauren Watson is live from near Palmer High School in downtown Colorado Springs this evening. And Lauren, one of several walkouts across our region happened at Palmer today. Adam, students of just about all ages walked out of their classes across southern Colorado today as a part of this national movement. We made it out to protests at Palmer, Fountain Fort Carson High, Sand Creek High and Columbia Elementary. According to the activist group, students demand action who organized the national walkout. Thousands of students walked out of more than 200 schools nationwide today. Students outside Fountain Fort Carson said one of their largest concerns was children much younger than them having to deal with the same fears they've had. Students at Columbia Elementary marched the block around their school with their parents and grandparents chanting, enough is enough. Parents I spoke with outside of Columbia said even their students who range from 6 to 11 are aware of gun violence in schools and wanted to make their voices heard. I think the kids were really proud of what they've done and they're, it's good for them to take a stand early on. Whatever side of the fence they're on with issues, for them to stand up for what they believe in and their rights. I spoke with several representatives for area school districts today. D11 said that any class missed because of this walkout will have to be excused by a parent or guardian. D49 said that students who walked out at Sand Creek will not be penalized, but will have to make up for that missing instruction on their own. Live in downtown Colorado Springs, Lauren Watson, KKTV 11 News. Okay, Lauren, thank you.